Hey guys, welcome to another video. In this video, I'm going to be doing a vlog style. And this is what I do at night. I'm, I'm in my office creating something. Um, I'm in the process of doing my office over. So as far as things that I have done, I have that corner done over there. Um, don't mind the Harry Potter water bottle. I have that little shelf done up there. Um, I'll be doing an office tour um, soon. And then over there, I still have to figure out what I want to do with my CDs. And then over here is a box that I'm not sure what I'm going to do with all that stuff. Some of that stuff needs to go into my memory box, but I have to clean that out. Then over here, this is the section that is done. Um, all of the pieces on the wall, the two hexagons, the L, the Be Brave, and the shadow box here are all from Michaels. I got them for a combined $15, 80% off. Yes, 80% off. So for all five of those pieces, it would have been $75. I got them for $15. That mirror has been in my family for like ever. I want to find something to put on top of my radiator. I'm not sure yet, but my shelf is done. I'm actually going to be moving this bag off the door. Um, just didn't get around to doing that yet. That's going to be going to my craft closet. That stuff there is going to be going to my guest room with my nephew's stuff. Um, tomorrow I'm going to be vacuuming. It is Friday night and it is August 26th. 10:56 p.m. So this is what I'm doing on my Friday night. I just get inspired at night and I go into my office and I work. And I have my fan on because it's pretty hot in here. The temperature outside right now is 84 degrees. So, and I'm on my third floor, basically the attic, so it's even hotter up here. So all of my books over here are good to go. Love, love, love my books. On the bottom, I have fiction and reference, and then in the middle are the inspirational on this side, then it goes into autobiographical on that side. That basket I was hoping would have sat on top of the radiator, but it's too big. So I sat it down there with um, some stuff in there that I'm going to be using for backdrops when I'm doing different videos. And then that bench is actually from my kitchen, but it's going to stay in here. Um, and I hope to film some videos for you guys over there. So that's that. That stuff over there, I still need to find something to do. Not the um, packaging paper. That's going to stay. Um, but the canvas back there, I went to a wine and painting. That um, other box is actually a gift box, which needs to go with the gift stuff in my closet downstairs, which is a work in progress. So anyway, tonight I am redoing my vision board. My vision board no longer matches my office so as for what I'm gonna be doing I'm gonna be using this paper first and foremost I have my glue gun just in case I need it I'm gonna be using this paper which I use to cover a magazine holder and it's from the mommy sheets and I'm also gonna be using this metallic tape and then I have all of my paper here because I'm thinking of doing it like um, circles so, ooh, that'd be cool. Okay, I think I have an idea in my head of what I want to do. Um, I still want to do my sections, and I still want it to be called Views from the Six. Um, I just want to update it. So, everything's going to be updated, but I want to make circles. And I'm going to make the circles using this... Um, I don't even want to use my photo paper, so I'm just going to use another cardstock that I have and just use the metallic tapes and cover them. So I'm going to do that. I don't want to use the computer paper because I think it's going to be too thin. So let me just come in here to a color. I'll take a couple sheets of this green one here. And I have my, where's my little stencil? I'm going to be tracing it with this. Actually, I think this might be, because my sections are working out, um, and I will be comparing because not everything is going to go onto my new vision board because I finished grad school, 
so that's not going to be going on. And I finished my office revamp, so everything else will be going on from here up, just not these two bottom sections because I accomplished them. So I'm really not going to throw this away. I'm going to fold it up and put it somewhere else. Um, it just doesn't match my decor anymore. But this was my um, vision board a couple months ago, and now going into fall, it's different. So I did get some things checked off. Um, I definitely want to get back into reading more, definitely work on my finances, working out, and of course blogging. Um, and my worship and staying focused. So that is what I'm gonna do. But I think this might be, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, give or take, seven sections that I need to make and this might be too big. So I'm gonna grab another one just in case. And ooh, I think I found which one I can use actually. And let me grab a pencil while I'm up here. Okay, I think instead of using this ginormous one, I'm just going to use this one instead and make my sections and then we'll get started. So...
right guys, so here is the completed vision board. So starting at the top, I still need to put something here that says views from the six. Um, I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to put there. But then over here, this is one of those rub-on stickers that I got. I featured it in my Michael's 80% off haul. So that says wild and free. And this one says dream big, shine bright. So starting over here, this is an organization that I want to start for lung cancer research. Then for my categories, finances, reading, fitness, worship, and blog and YouTube. So for blog and YouTube, I really just want to continue um, networking, do more collabs. I do want to make an editorial planner, um, free printables, eventually do a giveaway, continue doing my four posts or even more a week, continue to stick to my schedule, and eventually update my logo, which is something I'm working on. Then when it comes to finances, I want to be able to pay off my credit cards, um, loan repayments, my get my savings together, and do more couponing, which I know will save money. Then for reading books, I want to read like now. Um, what on earth am I here for? Um, and then my cousins wrote two books. One is Focus and then Before the Storm. And then Joyce Meyer's Battlefield of the Mind. And then what's great is that I can easily peel this up and put down new ones um, when I want to update it. Then for fitness, I really want to do meal prepping and cardio and I want to do a lung cancer run this year. I want to get back into boxing and strength training. And then for my worship, I definitely want to tithe and stay on my daily devotions. So that is it for my vision board. I absolutely love how it turned out. Like, oh, I'm in love. And like I showed you guys in the vlog of me putting it together, this is just little cardstock paper that I covered with that Heidi Swap metallic tape that I'll be talking about in like every DIY that I have until I run out of it. And I use gold and mainly silver. I really do like the silver one. So that is it. I will have pictures on the blog for you guys. But this matches my office now opposed to my other one. I really, 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 really am happy with it. So that is that. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to check out the blog, chaoticcritic.com. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Chaotic Critic. And let me know if you guys have a vision board somewhere in your home. And I'll see you in my next video.